Before you get married, you think you have a basic understanding of the English language. You know, simple words like the word we. Before you get married, the word we just means you and somebody else. Like, for example, we are going to the game. But then after you get married, that word we takes on whole new dimensions that never even entered your mind. Like, for example, there's the he we. Now with the he we, your wife will say something like, we need to mow the lawn. Now she actually has absolutely no intention of helping you mow the lawn. It's just her nice way of saying that you have to go and mow the lawn. And then there's the she we. This is where she's saying something to you similar to the he we, but from a completely different angle. So for example, she'll say something like, we need to get new drapes, or we need to get a new shaitel. Now obviously she has absolutely no intention of you buying a shaitel. Again, it's just her way of communicating to you something in a more pleasant manner. See, communication takes on a whole new realm once you get married. You can learn more about communication and its importance in marriage by going to theschmooze.com.